her face is likely familiar to you. Flyers with her image dotted much of Milwaukee. Kelly Dwyer has now been missing for nearly one year. Today, the man believed to be the last person to see her was in court. WISN 12 News Hillary Mintz is live now, and Hillary, right now, he's facing drug as well as child pornography charges. That's right, Toya. He was in court here this afternoon on unrelated charges to Dwyer's disappearance. But even though he's never been criminally charged to this missing persons case, her family continues to keep a close watch on every detail that could be linked to this young woman who disappeared this same time last year. Chris Zacco sits with his family in court Friday, challenging evidence from several search warrants conducted inside of his East Side apartment. Just days after his girlfriend Kelly Dwyer vanished in October 2013, the judge denied motions to suppress search warrants, and Zacco's attorneys also wanted to see surveillance video from outside of his building. We have not been provided any video. Keep in mind, Zacco's never been charged in Dwyer's disappearance, but was nailed for drug and child porn charges. Prosecutors agreed to let the defense see some of the videos and notes from investigators. Because this is an ongoing investigation, and to uh, the a missing persons investigation and at this point suspected homicide there's much confidential information contained in uh, those notes that is not uh, exculpatory to the defense or, or even uh, potentially relevant to the charges that are presently pending first of all I don't think the state's entitled to determine for the for the defense what is or is not relevant in terms of our preparation for the two cases. Meanwhile, a family waits for justice. And uh, the only guy who probably knows where she's at, he's not going to talk unless he's absolutely forced to. Uh, these charges are serious charges, and if it's close to conviction, our hope is, is that he ple pleads down and gives up uh, the whereabouts of Kelly. Now, I checked in with Milwaukee police this afternoon to see where things stand on the Kelly Dwyer case. They tell me that it's a very much an ongoing investigation for this missing persons case. And Zacco, he is due back in court here in a couple of weeks for a pretrial hearing. At the courthouse, I'm Hillary Mintz, WISN 12 News.